Hey, man, how's it going? He's an actor. Bravo two, take one. Director, videographer. So we've put an auto stabilizer on the shot. Mm. And now this talented Samoan is working on a new series, Shadow Peak. My friend up in Auckland, Sarah, had this idea for an interactive series where the audience gets to choose what the characters do, episode by episode. And so while I was filming Shortland Street on the side, I was also leaving the studio, going to Sarah's house and just writing down, how can we make this work? How can we tell a story using social media in the social way that it's meant to be used, whilst also having divergent storylines that come to, a, come to a head in the end? So, Shadow Peak, that's what we're working on now. Even though the series presents itself as a thriller, in the next few days, Jordan and his team need to reach 10K to get the project off the ground. We wrote the story, we pitched it everywhere, and then Boosted New Zealand came to us, and they were like, hey, look, we really like this story. We're working with Auckland City Council to try and boost the arts in Aotearoa. Um, how about we get you started on our platform? So Auckland City Council gave us our first $2,000, and we need $10,000 to make the whole series. And he credits his talent to his late Samoan grandfather. I grew up with my grandfather, and he's a really important figure in my life. Like, even he's probably the reason why I got into performing arts and acting, and who was always really big on taking me places to watch people and ask me about them. What did I think about them? Why did I walk this way? Why did they talk this way? And then I can just stem from that, just a love of observing people. And moving forward, Jordan is keen to find out more about his Pacific heritage. My grandfather passed away two months ago now, I think, so pretty fresh. Um, but I'm glad that I got that image finally of me and him. And it was actually an entry for the Pataka Museum, where I took an image of his father that I found at the British Museum, who was a Matai uh, Muifowo from Lufi Lufi, and was a really big part of the, the Mao movement. And I got that image and then I copied that style onto my grandfather, um, just to show the generations and the change. The piece that I made for Pataka was called Journey. And so the first frame of my great-grandfather was made out of top of cloth and, and wood. And then I wanted to show the different ways that they traveled. And so the other photo of my grandfather and myself was made out of those, um, you know, those big bags that everyone has, the, the stripy bags from the, yes. from the Asian stores. But for now, he just wants to concentrate on the project at hand. Writing, directing, yeah, co-creating, co-producing. Um, my, my team is amazing. Sarah Dawes is, is just fantastic. She came out with the idea and she's also in it. I'm acting in it as well. Um, so it'll be everything. And I think that's the nature of kind of guerrilla filmmaking in New Zealand. And if the audience is interested, if you want to know more, you go to boosted.org.nz and just search for Shadow Peak. Just everything about it's there.